Tiffany Haddish, like many other black actors, have had a point in life where they lost everything regardless of how talented they were in their fields. Oh, I lost everything. All my gigs gone. Everything gone. Monique spoke up about this situation, claiming for her case, she was blackballed by the industry's top moguls. Lee Daniels and I had a conversation, and he offered me the role of Cookie. I got a call back from him because I hadn't heard, and that's when he said, my mind, you've been blackballed. Well, these claims have brought up the question, who are the black actors that have been blackballed in Hollywood? And why? Let's get into it. In the heart of Los Angeles lies Hollywood a land of dreams where the glimmer of fame and the shadow of obscurity dance in a delicate balance. This world, known for its cinematic splendors and star-studded avenues, is also a realm where the rules are unwritten and the stakes are high. Here, the phenomenon of being blackballed, a term that conjures images of careers halted and opportunities vanished, is a stark reality for many, especially for actors of color. Let's embark on an exploratory journey into the lives of 13 black actors, each with a story that encapsulates the highs and lows of Hollywood. Their experiences, diverse and complex, offer a window into an industry that is as enigmatic as it is influential. These actors, celebrated for their talent and often scrutinized for their choices, represent more than just individual careers. They embody the broader dynamics of race, representation, and resilience in the entertainment world. From Monique's bold stance against industry inequalities to Stacey Dash's controversial political pivot, from Jussie Smollett's dramatic fall from grace to Wesley Snipes' legal battles, each story unfolds against the backdrop of Hollywood's ever-shifting landscape. Will Smith's journey from a beloved actor to a figure of contention, Isaiah Washington's career upheaval following his remarks, and Columbus Short's personal struggles impacting his professional life, these narratives are as varied as they are compelling. Each actor's story is a tapestry woven with threads of triumphs and challenges, public victories and private battles. Their experiences shed light on the intricate dance of maintaining fame and integrity in an industry where public perception can change at the speed of light. The narratives of these 13 actors, marked by moments of unparalleled achievement and instances of profound controversy, offer a deeper understanding of the complexities of fame, identity, and artistic expression in the modern entertainment landscape. Monique. Lee Daniels and I had a conversation, and he offered me the role of Cookie. I got a call back from him because I hadn't heard, and that's when he said, my mind, you've been blackballed. Monique's journey in Hollywood is a compelling narrative of resilience, talent, and defiance against industry norms. Her ascent to stardom was marked by a blend of humor and authenticity, qualities that endeared her to audiences worldwide. Her career reached an extraordinary peak with her Academy Award for Best Supporting Actress for her role in Precious. This achievement was not just a personal triumph, but also a moment of representation for black actresses in Hollywood. However, the aftermath of her Oscar win revealed the complexities and challenges of navigating the entertainment industry. Monique's outspokenness about the inequities she faced particularly regarding pay disparities and promotional expectations, positioned her in a contentious light within Hollywood circles. Her refusal to campaign for the Oscar without additional compensation was perceived as a breach of the unspoken rules of the industry. This stance, while rooted in a demand for fairness, led to a palpable shift in her career trajectory. Her experience after the Oscar win became a defining moment, highlighting the systemic issues within Hollywood. Monique's willingness to speak out against unfair practices brought to the forefront the struggles faced by black actresses, from inadequate compensation to limited opportunities. Her stance challenged the status quo and sparked conversations about the need for change in an industry often resistant to it. She claimed that she wasn't getting any jobs because she had been blackballed by industry moguls like Oprah Winfrey. For eight years, my family has suffered and my career has suffered. Oprah Winfrey, you know what you need to do. And Stop hiding. People are beginning to see you for who you are. Despite the professional setbacks that followed, Monique's spirit remained unbroken. She continued to be a vocal advocate for equality in Hollywood, using her platform to address issues of injustice and discrimination. Her journey transcended the narrative of a blackballed actress. It became a symbol of resistance against an industry often governed by inequitable practices. Stacy Dash. I cannot wait 
to help my people out. Happy Black History Month. Stacey Dash's trajectory in Hollywood is a tale of transformation and controversy, illustrating the impact of personal beliefs on a public career. Rising to fame with her role as Dion in the 1995 teen classic Clueless, Dash became a recognizable face in Hollywood. Her performance, marked by charm and wit, seemed to promise a flourishing acting career. However, the path that unfolded for Dash was far from straightforward. In the years following her early success, Dash's career took a turn that few anticipated. She ventured into the realm of political commentary, a move that dramatically altered her public persona and career trajectory. Her outspoken conservative views, particularly her criticism of Barack Obama and her stance on various social issues, positioned her in stark contrast to the predominantly liberal leanings of Hollywood. It shouldn't be a Black History Month. You know, we're Americans, period. That's it. Are you saying there shouldn't be a Black History Month because there isn't a White History Month? Exactly. Dash's foray into political commentary was not just a career shift, but also a source of significant controversy. Her appearances on news networks and her statements on social media sparked intense debates and backlash. In an industry where personal beliefs can significantly impact professional opportunities, Dash's political alignment and public statements put her at odds with many of her peers and the Hollywood establishment. This shift in her career raised questions about the intersection of entertainment and politics. Dash's experience highlighted the challenges faced by actors who publicly express political views that diverge from the mainstream narrative in Hollywood. Her story became emblematic of the complexities of navigating a public career in an industry that is as much about image and perception as it is about talent and artistry. Moreover, Dash's journey in Hollywood reflects the broader dynamics of celebrity and political activism. Her transition from an actress to a political commentator underscores the delicate balance public figures must maintain between their professional personas and personal convictions. It also speaks to the polarizing nature of politics in the public sphere and the consequences that can arise when personal beliefs are thrust into the spotlight. Jussie Smollett. How is this part of you working your way back into Hollywood? And, and, and you know, I've never thought of myself as working my way. Well, no, no, no. Jussie Smollett's story in Hollywood is a complex narrative of ambition, controversy, and a dramatic fall from grace. His rise to fame was marked by his portrayal of Jamal Lyon on the popular TV series Empire. Smollett's character, an openly gay black man, was groundbreaking and earned him acclaim for both his acting skills and his role in advancing representation on television. However, the trajectory of his burgeoning career took an unexpected and tumultuous turn. In January 2019, Smollett reported being the victim of a hate crime in Chicago, an incident that quickly captured national attention. The initial outpouring of support for Smollett soon gave way to skepticism as details emerged, suggesting that he might have orchestrated the attack himself. This development led to a media frenzy, with public opinion shifting dramatically against him. You are fined $25,000, which is the maximum fine, and you will spend the first 150 days of your sentence in the Cook County Jail. And that will start today. The implications of the case were far-reaching. Smollett faced legal battles, including a 16-count indictment for allegedly filing a false police report, which was later dropped and then reinstated in a new indictment. This legal saga not only cast a shadow over his personal reputation, but also raised serious questions about his future in Hollywood. The controversy surrounding Smollett became a subject of intense debate, touching on sensitive issues of race, S, and the authenticity of hate crime reports. As the legal and media drama unfolded, Smollett's career suffered significant setbacks. He was written out of the final episodes of Empire, and his future projects became uncertain. The incident highlighted the precarious nature of fame in Hollywood and how quickly public perception can shift, impacting an actor's career and standing in the industry. Smollett's case also sparked broader discussions about the responsibilities of public figures and the impact of their actions on their careers and public discourse. 
His story is a cautionary tale about the consequences of personal decisions in the public A and the complex interplay between personal identity, public perception, and professional success in Hollywood. In the wake of the controversy, Smollett's career and reputation remain in a state of uncertainty. His story is not just about the alleged incident, but also about the challenges of navigating fame and controversy in an industry where the line between personal and professional life is often blurred. Wesley Snipes. I'll just enjoy better. Wesley Snipes' career in Hollywood is a saga of remarkable talent, significant achievements, and notable legal battles. Snipes, a versatile actor and skilled martial artist, first captivated audiences in the 1990s with a series of successful films. His roles in New Jack City, White Men Can't Jump, and the Blade trilogy showcased his range, charisma, and unique presence on screen. Snipes quickly became a prominent figure in Hollywood, known for his action roles and dramatic performances. However, Snipes's flourishing career faced a major setback due to legal issues. In the early 2000s, he became embroiled in a high-profile tax evasion case. The legal battle that ensued was lengthy and complex, culminating in Snipes being convicted of willful failure to file federal income tax returns. In 2010, he began serving a three-year prison sentence, a development that marked a significant hiatus in his acting career and public life. The tax evasion case against Snipes brought to light the challenges actors face when personal legal issues intersect with their professional lives. His conviction and subsequent imprisonment became a major talking point, overshadowing his previous accomplishments and altering the public's perception of him. The situation highlighted the precarious nature of fame and how quickly an actor's career can be impacted by off-screen actions. Upon his release, Snipes attempted to rekindle his career, appearing in films like The Expendables 3 and Coming to America. While these roles marked his return to the big screen, they did not fully recapture the momentum his career once had. The aftermath of his legal troubles posed a challenge to his standing in Hollywood, a testament to the difficulty of rebuilding a public image and career in an industry that is quick to move on. Snipes' story is a cautionary tale about the consequences of legal troubles and the complex journey of redemption in Hollywood. It underscores the thin line between personal and professional life in the entertainment industry and the impact of legal issues on public perception and career trajectory. Will Smith. And if Boris finds him before we do, that sucks bad. Will Smith's journey in Hollywood is a multifaceted story of immense success, personal evolution, and a moment of controversy that reverberated around the world. Rising to fame in the 1990s with the beloved television series The Fresh Prince of Bel-Air, Smith seamlessly transitioned to the big screen, becoming one of Hollywood's most bankable stars. His roles in blockbuster hits like Independence Day, Men in Black, and Alley showcased his charismatic on-screen presence and versatility, earning him critical and commercial acclaim. Smith's career trajectory seemed to embody the Hollywood dream, marked by a series of successes that solidified his status as a global superstar. However, his journey took an unexpected turn at the 2022 Academy Awards. In a moment that shocked audiences worldwide, Smith confronted and slapped comedian Chris Rock on stage, a response to a joke made by Rock about Smith's wife, Jada Pinkett Smith. This incident, broadcast live to millions, instantly became a subject of intense public scrutiny and debate. <laughs> oh, wow! Wow! Will Smith just smacked the sh out of me. The repercussions of this event were immediate and significant. Smith faced widespread criticism for his actions, which were seen as unprofessional and damaging to his public image. The incident sparked a broader conversation about decorum, respect, and the boundaries of humor and personal conduct in public settings. In the aftermath, Smith resigned from the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences and faced a ban from attending Academy events for 10 years. This incident highlighted the fragile nature of public perception and the impact of personal conduct on a professional career in Hollywood. Smith, who had maintained a largely positive public image throughout his career, found himself at the center of a controversy that called into question his judgment and professionalism. 
The event also underscored the intense scrutiny faced by public figures and the high stakes of their actions in the public eye. Isaiah Washington. In 2007, when you left Grey's Anatomy, there was so much conversation around your departure because you had allegedly made a homophobic comment about your former co-star. Isaiah Washington's career in Hollywood is a narrative marked by talent, controversy, and the repercussions of personal actions in the public sphere. Washington, known for his role as Dr. Preston Burke on the acclaimed TV series Grey's Anatomy, showcased his acting prowess, earning him a reputation as a strong performer. However, his journey took a dramatic turn following an incident that would significantly impact his career trajectory. The controversy began with Washington's use of a homophobic slur on the set of Grey's Anatomy. The incident, which became widely reported and discussed, led to intense backlash against Washington. In an industry increasingly sensitive to issues of inclusivity and respectful conduct, his comments were met with strong condemnation. The fallout was swift and severe. Washington's contract with Gray's Anatomy was not renewed, marking a sudden and stark decline in his professional journey. Washington's experience in Hollywood following the incident highlights the complex interplay between personal beliefs, public behavior, and professional opportunities. His remarks, which he publicly apologized for, nonetheless cast a long shadow over his career. Post Gray's Anatomy, Washington found it challenging to secure roles of similar prominence, a testament to the lasting impact of controversies in the public eye. Moreover, Washington's story raises important questions about redemption and second chances in Hollywood. The entertainment industry, while often priding itself on progressiveness and tolerance, also grapples with how to respond to the personal failings of its stars. Washington's journey is reflective of this dilemma, illustrating the challenges actors face in rebuilding their careers and reputations following public controversies. In the years that followed, Washington attempted to navigate a path forward, taking on roles in smaller projects and speaking out about his experiences and perspectives on the incident. His story is not just about the consequences of a moment of indiscretion, but also about the broader themes of accountability, redemption, and the ongoing struggle for personal and professional rehabilitation in Hollywood. Columbus Short. It is bittersweet, man. That is exactly the way to call it. I think it's bittersweet. But I did love what I did on Scandal, you know what I mean? Columbus Short's career in Hollywood is a narrative of stark contrasts, marked by promising highs and tumultuous lows. Bursting onto the scene with his dynamic performance in Stomp the Yard, Short quickly established himself as a talented actor and dancer. His charisma and skill earned him a role on the hit TV series Scandal, where he played the savvy Harrison Wright. This role not only showcased his acting abilities, but also positioned him as a rising star in Hollywood, seemingly set for a long and successful career. However, Short's professional ascent was abruptly interrupted by a series of personal and legal challenges. His life off-screen began to attract more attention than his on-screen performances. Reports of domestic violence incidents and substance abuse issues started to surface, casting a shadow over his rising star. These personal struggles were not just tabloid fodder, they had real consequences for his career. In 2014, Short made a shocking announcement. He was leaving Scandal. This departure was a significant blow to his career. The show had been a critical and commercial success, and his role was a fan favorite. Leaving Scandal meant not only losing a steady job, but also stepping away from a platform that had significantly raised his profile. The aftermath of his departure from Scandal was a testament to how quickly fortunes can change in Hollywood. Roles that were once readily offered to him became scarce, and his presence in the industry waned. Short's story is a vivid illustration of the delicate balance between personal life and public image in Hollywood. In an industry where perception can be as important as talent, personal missteps can have far-reaching impacts on an actor's career. In the years following his exit from Scandal, Short has worked to address his personal issues and find his footing again in the industry. His journey is reflective of the challenges many actors face in navigating the complexities of personal life while living in the public eye. It highlights the themes of resilience and redemption, underscoring the notion that personal growth and professional recovery can be a challenging yet possible path in Hollywood. Darius McCrary. When the show first started, 
there was a character that was played by Jamie Foxworth. Yes. Darius McCrary's journey in Hollywood is a narrative that encapsulates the challenges of transitioning from a child actor to an adult performer and the complexities of typecasting in the entertainment industry. McCrary, who rose to fame as Eddie Winslow on the beloved sitcom Family Matters, became a household name in the 1990s, endeared him to audiences, etching his character into the fabric of American pop culture. However, the very role that brought McCrary fame, after Family Matters ended, he found himself grappling with the industry's tendency to typecast actors. McCrary's strong association with Eddie Winslow made it challenging for casting directors and audiences to see him in a different light. This typecasting is a common plight in Hollywood, where actors often struggle to break free from the shadows of their most iconic roles. McCrary's post-Family Matters career was marked by efforts to diversify his roles and showcase his range as an actor. He appeared in a variety of projects, from television shows to films, but often found himself in roles that did not match the prominence or impact of Eddie Winslow. This struggle highlights a broader issue faced by many actors, particularly those who achieve fame at a young age, the difficulty of navigating the transition to more matery roles and escaping the pigeonhole of past characters. Moreover, McCrary's journey sheds light on the challenges of sustaining a long-term career in Hollywood. The industry, with its constant influx of new talent and changing trends, can be unforgiving to actors attempting to evolve or reinvent themselves. McCrary's experience underscores the relentless pace of the entertainment world and the need for continuous adaptation and reinvention. In recent years, McCrary has continued to work in the industry, taking on roles in various productions and exploring other artistic avenues. His persistence in the face of typecasting and the challenges of transitioning from a child actor to an adult performer is a testament to his resilience and dedication to his craft. Halle Berry uh, welcome to the program. Thank Thanks you. for coming with us. It's good to be back. You know, I was here on the first week of your show. Do you remember that? Halle Berry's narrative in Hollywood is one of groundbreaking achievements, interwoven with challenges that underscore the complexities of the industry, especially for black actresses. Berry's historic Oscar win for Best Actress in Monsters Ball in 2002 marked a significant milestone not only in her career but also in the annals of Hollywood. She became the first African-American woman to receive this accolade, a triumph that symbolized a breakthrough in an industry long critiqued for its lack of diversity and representation. However, Barry's journey post-Oscar victory revealed the nuanced challenges of sustaining success in Hollywood. Despite her monumental achievement, Barry faced difficulties in finding roles that matched the caliber of her talent and the significance of her Oscar win. This struggle highlighted a broader issue in Hollywood. The scarcity of substantial and nuanced roles for black actresses, even those with proven talent and critical acclaim. Barry's experience brought to light the industry's slow progress in terms of diversity and the often tokenistic approach to representation. Moreover, Barry's career post-Oscar was not without its trials. She faced criticism for some of her film choices and navigated personal challenges that were highly publicized. These aspects of her journey reflect the relentless scrutiny faced by actors in the public eye and the pressure to continually prove oneself despite past achievements. Despite these challenges, Barry's resilience and commitment to her craft remained steadfast. She continued to take on diverse roles, pushing against the boundaries of typecasting and industry expectations. Her directorial debut with Bruised was a testament to her versatility and determination to create opportunities where they were lacking. Barry's story in Hollywood is emblematic of the complexities faced by black actresses, the balancing act between achieving success and navigating an industry that often falls short in providing equitable opportunities. Her journey is not just a narrative of personal triumphs and challenges, but also a reflection of the broader conversation about representation, diversity, and the evolution of Hollywood. Nate Parker. Do you feel guilty about anything that happened that night? I don't feel guilty. Nate Parker's story in Hollywood is a complex tapestry of critical acclaim, personal controversy, and the interplay of past and present in shaping a public career. Parker, who wrote, 
directed, and starred in the acclaimed film The Birth of a Nation, initially appeared to be on a trajectory that would establish him as a significant force in the industry. The film, which premiered at the Sundance Film Festival, received a standing ovation and was hailed for its powerful portrayal of a slave rebellion led by Nat Turner. However, as Parker's star was ascending, a past incident resurfaced that dramatically altered the course of his career. Parker was accused of S-assault during his college years, a case in which he was ultimately acquitted. Despite the acquittal, the re-emergence of the allegations coincided with the promotional campaign for The Birth of a Nation, casting a long shadow over what was initially seen as a groundbreaking project. The controversy surrounding Parker raised complex questions about the intersection of personal history and professional life in Hollywood. The intense scrutiny and public debate over the allegations led to a significant backlash against Parker, affecting both the reception of The Birth of a Nation and his career prospects. This situation highlighted the industry's often unforgiving nature when it comes to personal controversies, especially in an era where social media and public opinion can swiftly influence an individual's career. Parker's experience also touched on broader themes of redemption, accountability, and the impact of historical context on contemporary issues. The industry's response to his past raised questions about the extent to which an individual's history should impact their professional opportunities. It also sparked discussions about the standards to which artists are held and the complexities of navigating a career in the public eye. In the aftermath of the controversy, Parker's career entered a period of uncertainty. His story is not just about the alleged incident, but also about the challenges of navigating fame and controversy in an industry where the line between personal and professional life is often blurred. CeeLo Green CeeLo Green's journey in Hollywood is a multifaceted story of musical genius, television success, and controversy that highlights the delicate balance between artistry and public perception. Known for his soulful voice and flamboyant style, Green first gained prominence as part of the hip-hop group Goody Mob before achieving widespread fame with Gnarls Barkley's hit Crazy. His solo career further solidified his status as a musical innovator, particularly with the success of the song Forget You. Green's foray into television as a judge on The Voice expanded his audience and showcased his charismatic personality, endearing him to millions of viewers. His role on the show not only highlighted his musical expertise, but also brought out his affable and mentor-like qualities. However, Green's flourishing career faced significant challenges due to personal controversies that emerged, impacting his public image and career trajectory. In 2012, Green faced accusations of cell battery, although charges were eventually dropped due to insufficient evidence. However, it was his subsequent comments on Twitter regarding consent and R that sparked a significant public backlash. Green's tweets were widely criticized for their insensitivity and perceived trivialization of serious issues. The fallout from these comments was immediate and far-reaching. Green parted ways with The Voice, and several of his scheduled performances and appearances were canceled. These incidents underscore the precarious nature of public opinion in the entertainment industry and how quickly it can shift. Green's experience highlights the impact that personal conduct and public statements can have on a professional career, especially in an era where social media plays a pivotal role in shaping public perception. Following the controversy, Green sought to rebuild his career and reputation. He released new music and made attempts to return to television, but the shadow of the controversy lingered. Green's journey in Hollywood is a reminder of the delicate balance that artists must maintain between their personal lives and public personas. Jason Mitchell. Jason Mitchell's story in Hollywood is a tale of rapid rise, critical acclaim, and a precipitous fall, illustrating the fragile nature of fame and the impact of personal conduct on a professional career. Mitchell burst onto the scene with a standout performance as Easy e in the biopic Straight Outta Compton. His portrayal of the iconic rapper was lauded for its depth and authenticity, earning him critical acclaim and marking him as a rissing star in the industry. Mitchell's portrayal in Straight Outta Compton seemed to herald the arrival of a significant new talent in Hollywood. 
his performance opened doors to more prominent roles, and he quickly began to build a reputation as a talented and versatile actor. However, the promising trajectory of Mitchell's career took a dramatic turn due to allegations of misconduct. In 2019, Mitchell faced multiple allegations of inappropriate behavior, which led to his removal from the TV series The Chai and the cancellation of his involvement in other projects. He was also dropped by his agent and manager. These allegations and the subsequent actions taken by those in the industry underscored the changing landscape in Hollywood, particularly in the wake of the Me Too movement, where issues of conduct and respect are taken with utmost seriousness. The fallout from these allegations was swift and severe, reflecting the industry's increasingly zero-tolerance stance on issues of harassment and misconduct. Mitchell's rapid fall from grace highlighted the precarious nature of fame in Hollywood, where personal behavior can have immediate and far-reaching consequences on an actor's career. Mitchell's case also brought to light the complexities of navigating fame and personal conduct in the public eye. In an industry where reputation and public perception can significantly impact career opportunities, allegations of misconduct can be particularly damaging. Mitchell's experience is a stark reminder of the high stakes involved in maintaining a professional persona that aligns with the industry's evolving standards of conduct. In the aftermath of the controversy, Mitchell's career and public image have faced significant challenges. His story is not just about the allegations themselves, but also about the broader themes of accountability, the impact of personal actions on professional opportunities, and the ongoing struggle for redemption in Hollywood. Dave Chappelle. I know I've been gone for a very long time. And unbeknownst to you, it was a difficult 10 years. Dave Chappelle's journey in Hollywood is a compelling saga of talent, controversy, and resilience, painting a vivid picture of the complexities of fame and creative expression. Chappelle, renowned for his sharp wit and incisive social commentary, first gained major attention with Chappelle's show. The comedy sketch series, which aired in the early 2000s, was groundbreaking in its approach, tackling issues of race, culture, and politics with a mix of humor and raw honesty. However, at the height of its success, Chappelle made a surprising decision to step away from the show and took a hiatus from Hollywood to Africa, citing the pressure and ethical concerns about the direction of the show. Chappelle's return to the spotlight years later was marked by a series of highly successful stand-up specials on Netflix. These specials were a testament to his enduring appeal and talent, but they also sparked new controversies. Chappelle's humor, particularly his jokes about transgender people and the LGBTQ community, drew criticism and accusations of insensitivity. These controversies highlighted the evolving standards of comedy and the tension between creative freedom and social responsibility. Chappelle's response to the criticism was characteristic of his approach to comedy and fame. He addressed the controversies head-on in his stand-up routines, refusing to shy away from difficult conversations. This approach has earned him both admiration for his artistic integrity and criticism for his perceived insensitivity. Chappelle's story is reflective of the broader debates in society about the boundaries of comedy, freedom of expression, and the role of comedians in challenging societal norms. Moreover, Chappelle's career trajectory offers insights into the complexities of navigating fame in Hollywood. His initial departure from Chappelle's show and subsequent return highlight the challenges artists face in balancing personal values with professional pressures. Chappelle's journey underscores the importance of authenticity in an industry often dominated by commercial considerations. As we conclude our exploration into the lives and careers of these 13 black actors, their stories collectively paint a vivid portrait of Hollywood's multifaceted nature. Each narrative, unique in its triumphs and tribulations, offers a deeper understanding of the complexities within the entertainment industry, especially as they pertain to issues of race, representation, and personal conduct. From Monique's courageous stance against industry inequalities to Stacey Dash's controversial political pivot, from Jussie Smollett's dramatic fall from grace to Wesley Snipes's legal battles, and from Will Smith's moment of contention to Isaiah Washington's career upheaval, these stories are a mosaic of experiences. They highlight the delicate balance between personal life and public image, the challenges of navigating fame, and the ongoing struggle for equitable representation in Hollywood.
Columbus Short's personal struggles, Darius McCrary's battle against typecasting, Halle Berry's resilience in the face of limited opportunities, Nate Parker's confrontation with his past, CeeLo Green's journey of redemption, Jason Mitchell's rapid rise and fall, and Dave Chappelle's controversial yet impactful career. Each of these narratives contributes to a broader discourse on the dynamics of fame and the intricacies of life in the public eye. These stories, while centered around individual experiences, reflect the collective challenges and triumphs of black actors in Hollywood. They underscore the need for continued progress towards inclusivity and diversity in the industry. The narratives of these 13 individuals serve as a testament to the enduring spirit of artists who navigate the complex waters of Hollywood, highlighting the importance of resilience, authenticity, and the pursuit of artistic integrity in an ever-evolving industry. That's it for this video. See you next time.